DC coupling means to connect the PV generator and the battery on the DC side of the inverter instead of the AC side. And it's, it's the much better and more preferred uh, solution when it comes to a co-location of PV generation and battery storage. Generally, having a battery storage in the system enables much more business cases for the independent power producer, the IPP. Electrical energy, for example, can be provided during times of high energy needs and make the IPP more independent from the time when the sun is shining. The advantages for the grid operator is that the existing grid can be utilized much better and without costly grid extensions. PV generated energy can be stored and fed into the grid when the price for the kilowatt hour is higher or the sun does not shine. Storage makes the behavior of the PV plant on the grid very similar to conventional power plants. This is an important step to an even higher share of renewable energy production. Connecting the battery on the DC side of the inverter instead of the AC side saves a separate battery inverter and the transformer as well. That means less investment in equipment, so lower carpex, and less losses in the system. And the system is available now or in case of the PV plant with future storage extension. The DC-DC combiner as well as the battery can be added later on, for example, when battery prices have come down further.